pizza kind of reordered my pizza priorities. I was able to say, okay, this is what a great pizza tastes like, and then compare all the others. And all the other ones go down. The hell with the other pizza. Pizzeria Bianco in Phoenix, Arizona, to me, trumps all other pizzas. It just kind of blows them out of the water. This guy only does six pizzas. They're not all gooped up. I trust you. But what I really like is the Rosa. The Rosa has Parmesan, rosemary, red onion, and most definitively, it has Arizona raised pistachios. For those out there who might not think pistachio belongs on a pizza, I'd just say go to Pizzeria Bianco, order the Pizzeria Rosa, and see what you think later. This pizza reminds you that pizza is bread. The crust has this wonderful chewiness to it. There's real savor to the bread. The secret to the crust is practice with it. I've been making this for a long, long time. You know, I opened my first place 20 years ago. Whatever goodness I have is from the bird ones. If you look into the restaurant, there's a bar over the left here, there's a table sitting here. But the thing that the light from heaven shines down upon is the pizza oven. I make all the pizza. Sometimes people are like, oh my God, no one can do it and better. It's, it has nothing to do with that. It's like, you came to my house, I want to make it for you. That's what I want working on my pizza. I want this guy who's not gallivanting around the restaurant. He's at the pizza oven working it. And he's happy. I like it. It's really that good. You get the resiny taste of rosemary and this high nutty taste, kind of the natural sweetness out of the pistachio. Um, this wonderful blistered to hell crust. If you haven't tasted this pizza, then you don't know what's possible with pizza. Relax, bro.